So, Happy New Year everyone and welcome to my very first video from over here in Mallorca for 2024. Don't forget if you are new to my channel to consider subscribing because I'm going to look forward to making many more videos to help you with your holiday this summer. I've already got plenty of travel guides already on my channel so make sure you go and check those out but I'm very much looking forward to the summer season ahead and bringing you the very best holiday guides, the best holiday news and the travel tips as well if you're hoping to come on holiday over here to Mallorca so hit that subscribe button and you may see some lights appear around that button too if you go and check that out. But first of all, I've got what, well, it could be some slightly worrying news coming out of Spain today. It hasn't affected us directly yet in Mallorca, but it could be coming here soon. And you may well have read in the national press today that face mask wearing is now gone back to being obligatory in medical centres, in health centres over in the Canary Islands. So we're talking Tenerife, Lanzarote, Fuerteventura and Gran Canaria. Now the government here in the Balearic Islands has said that it's unnecessary at the moment so that we need to wear face masks if we are visiting health centres and hospitals. However, the reality here is just a little bit different and well, when we arrived back into Palma Airport just last week, I noticed a high amount of travellers actually coming into the airport wearing face masks. I've also been very surprised the past couple of days too and seeing a lot of people in shopping centres and in supermarkets also wearing face masks. And it's been a little bit of a blast back to pandemic times to being out and about and seeing everybody wearing face masks too. The same goes as well on public transport as well. I've seen a lot of face mask wearers too. However, wearing a face mask at the moment is simply because of the reported rise of flu cases here. We're not talking about the C word, actually. I'm not going to mention it. But we've actually got a higher rate of normal flu cases on the island. And, and apparently the hospitals are slightly overloaded with admissions with people suffering from flu. So, and this is why people have gone back to wearing face masks again. Now, as I've said, it's non-obligatory here in Mallorca. But it kind of is at the same time because I actually went down to my medical centre in San Augustine, just on the outskirts of Parma, this morning to go and renew, renew my health cards to find that actually everyone in that health centre was wearing a face mask. There was even a box of face masks as well on the reception and it was kind of hinted that we should actually be wearing them. So, so we were kind of not told to put them on but it was kind of assumed that we would actually need to wear them if we're going into a health centre. So while the government have said it's not necessary I think people are making their own minds up about this. So how is this going to affect you if you're coming over here on holiday? Well I know we've got a few winter breakers coming out here to Mallorca over the next month or so to enjoy maybe some hill walking and to see Mallorca out of peak season. So do you have to wear a face mask coming over on the plane? Well not yet and I would say if you are flying over here and you do want to fa wear a face mask because it makes you feel more comfortable then by all means do so. We had quite a few people on our flight coming over the other day that were, were wearing face masks so my recommendation is with a high number of flu cases if it makes you feel more, more comfortable then maybe pop a face mask on coming over on your flight because you really don't want to get sick if you're over here on holiday. Now could things change in the coming days with regards to wearing face masks over here? Quite possibly so so I wouldn't be surprised if the governments do make the wearing of face masks in pharmacies and health centres obligatory once again. And let us not forget as well that Spain was one of the last countries in Europe to, Europe to drop all restrictions. So it could quite easily come back in again. Who knows? But for the time being, if you're coming here on holiday, if you're coming over here for a winter break, if you're using public transport, wear a face mask if you feel it's necessary. Keep an eye on the press as well. Keep an eye on the Facebook group, on my YouTube channel as well. If anything changes, I shall update you as to whether you should bring them or not. They're still available quite cheaply in supermarkets as well. So don't worry too much if you're coming over here without them and you do need to pick up a packet. Of course, shops like Mercadona and Euroski as well are still selling them as pharmacies are as well too and also as well going into the health centre as well they were giving them away free this morning so um, that's just a top tip if you're coming over don't worry too much if you can no longer find them in your supermarkets particularly back in the UK. 
Okay, everyone, that's just a very quick update from here on Magaluf Beach. I'm now going to go and make another video, which is going to help you with planning your holiday for next summer as well, because we've got a couple of big changes over here in Magaluf. But I shall catch you on that video. Okay, everyone, thanks very much for watching. Don't forget, you can find me in the Facebook group and on my Instagram, also called Mallorca Under the Sun. And I've got loads more hints and tips on my website on MallorcaUnderTheSun.com. Don't forget there's going to be a live stream at the weekend and I shall see you on the next video. Goodbye for now.